on behalf of all the people who are part of Galazzo Trail 2024. Thank you very much for your confidence in the race. We hope that the event will meet your expectations and that you will enjoy your time in the mountains of Calvia. Now we need you to pay attention to this video briefing, which covers some of the essential points of the race. Remember that on the galazzotrail.com website, you can also find it in Spanish and Catalan. Schedules, Galazzo Legend. Start, 8.30 a.m. on the morning of Sunday, March 10th. Place of start and finish, Plaza de Savinia in Es Cap de la. The closing of the race will be at 6 p.m. at the finish line. As schedules, Galazzo Half. Start, 10 a.m. on Sunday, March 10th. Place of departure and arrival, Plaza de Savinia de Es Cap de la. Mandatory equipment, important to the mandatory materials that you must carry throughout the race, that is mobile phone, glass or bottle, thermal blanket, race number always visible, and chip, you must add one more, a waterproof breathable jacket of 10,000 millimeters. This addition is made taking into account the weather forecast for the event and the guidelines of the Balearic Mountain and Climbing Federation. Weather forecast. As of Friday the 8th of March, the weather forecast for Sunday 10th in the area where the race will take place indicates the presence of wind, approximately 40 kilometers per H, the possibility of between 5 and 20% of rain and temperatures on the summits of approximately 5 degrees centigrade. We will continue to monitor the meteorological evolution in the area over the next few hours. And if we have to make decisions about the course of the race, they will be taken together with the Balearic Federation of Mountaineering and Climbing on Sunday the 10th of March at 7.30 a.m. and will be communicated to the participants before the start of the race. For the moment, the only confirmed change is the need for participants to add to their mandatory equipment a minimum 10,000 mm waterproof jacket. Important, as the terrain will be wet, please exercise extreme caution during the race especially on the descents and rocky areas. Telephone and emergencies. Remember to bring your mobile phone on and with the battery charged. You must save our emergency telephone number in your diary, prefix plus 34, number 629 852 862. If you call us and do not get an answer, try WhatsApp. You must also have the My112 application downloaded on your mobile to report in case of no emergency response on the mobile. Abandonment. In case you want to abandon the race before doing so, you must notify the organization. You can tell the race judges, volunteers, staff at the aid stations, or health personnel. If you do not notify us, we will put the emergency services to work on your search. Areas with expected abandonment, Bol de Eses Cerveres, Kilometer 18.1 Legend, Kilometer 14 Half. Padena Sabatera, Kilometer 22 Legend, Calamo on Biel, Kilometer 33.5 Legend. Respect the environment. The race takes place almost entirely in a natural environment of great scenic interest, with special protection areas such as the Galazzo, Sesclop-Lic, and the Puig de Nabausalic which are part of the Natura 2000 network. We ask you to respect the environment at all times and to the maximum that you take into account the decalogue of good practices of the Balearic Mountain Federation, which you can find in the race book, and that your visit to Galazzo does not generate a great impact. Galazzo Legend. In this section of the briefing, we deal with the specific aspects that people who participate in this distance must take into account. Doubleway sections in Galazzo. Legend. At kilometer 12.5 of Galazzo Legend, there is a section of about 600 meters that runs along a narrow two-way road. Remember that you should always run on the left. Neutralized section in Galazzo. Legend. At kilometer 22.8, we find a 700 meter uphill and downhill section that serves to crown the top of Galazzo. Running is not allowed in this section, it is a neutralized section. Failure to comply with this rule is grounds for disqualification from the race. Cut off times. 
the maximum time to complete Galatzar legend is 9.5 hours. Participants are required to enter within the following partial times that are established along the route. There will be two cutoff points established for the legend distance, no eliminatory penalties. First point, 12.45 p.m. in the Padana Sabatera, before beginning the ascent to the top of Galatzo, kilometer 22.4. Participants who arrive after 12.45 p.m. will not be able to start the ascent to the top of Galatzo. They will be able to continue the route towards the Col de Sa Moleta Rasa. The penalty for not exceeding this cutoff time will be one hour to be added to the final time of the race. Second point, GR 221 with SE's planes at kilometer 33. Participants who arrive after 3.30 p.m. at this point will not be able to start the route between Calamo in Biel, Raxo, Safont Nova, and return to the GR 221 junction with SE's planes, passing directly in the direction of S. Capdela. The penalty for not exceeding this cutoff time will be two hours to be added to the final time of the race. People who have not passed any of these partial cutoff points may not be classified ahead of those who have completed the entire route. So in the event that their final time adding the penalty is less than that of the last participating person who has completed the circuit, one minute will be added to the time of that last classified person. People who have not passed any of these cutoff points will be considered finishers of the distance they have actually completed. The closing of the Galatzor Legend Race is established at 6 o'clock. People who do not reach the finish line before that time will be disqualified. Galazzo Legend Aid stations. You can find water, cola, isotonic, bananas, oranges, almonds, peanuts, hazelnuts, dates, dried apricots, pieces of energy bar, chocolate and jelly beans. In those areas, you will also find waste collection places. The Galazzo Legend aid stations are as follows. Aid stations 1 and 3, Pudieses Seniors, kilometers 10 and 30. Aid station 2, Bol de SS Severas, kilometer 18.2. Aid stations 4 and 5, Calamo and Biel, kilometers 33.5 and 39.5. Aid Station 6 at the finish line. The signage for Galazzo Legend will consist of red and white delimiting tape, sticks in mountain areas and arrows at important turns. Galazzo Half. In this section of the briefing, we deal with the specific aspects that people who participate in this distance must take into account. Sections of special attention in Galazzo Half. At kilometer 8.3 of Galazzo Half, we will find a 600 meter stretch of narrow two-way path. Remember that you must always go to your left. Galazzo, half aid stations. You can find water, cola, isotonic, bananas, oranges, almonds, peanuts, hazelnuts, dates, dried apricots, pieces of energy bar, chocolate and jelly beans. In those areas, you will also find waste collection places. The Galatso half aid stations points are as follows. Aid stations 1 and 3, Pudieses Sinius, kilometers 6 and 18. Aid station 2, Bol SES Severas, kilometer 14. Aid station 4 at the finish line. The signage for Galatso half will consist of red and white delimiting tape, sticks in mountain areas and arrows at important turns. Sanitary services in the race. We will have different assistants and health teams on the route and in the start and finish areas. The company that will coordinate the health services is Falk. We will also have the assistance of Civil Protection. Here we show you the location of the different assistance services. Start and finish line zone, medical attention point and coordination center, civil protection point at kilometers 7.5 10, 30, and 32.5. One fast intervention vehicle in Coma Don Vidal, kilometer 17.6. Two ambulances in the Bol de SES Cerveras, kilometer 17.6. An assistance vehicle for minor evacuees at Font des Pi, kilometer 21. 
An ambulance at Calamo in Biel, kilometer 33.5 and 39.5. Five assistance technicians on the route. They will always be in the race queue. Services. We want you to have at your disposal everything you need to enjoy the race. Aid stations. Transfers from Pagera and Calvia. Changing room and shower service at the Palau de Espoir de Calvia. Volunteers for care and follow-up. Global coverage health services, cloakroom service, recovery service and physiotherapists, aid station at the finish line, etc. You can check all the race services on the web, galazzotrail.com. The celebration of Galazzo Trail is very important for the municipality of Calvia. It serves to position the area as an ideal place to train and compete at any time of the year and generates a significant economic impact. In addition, Galazzo Trail must contribute to community development, so the organization works to meet the sustainable development goals in the event, incorporating a set of actions aimed at protecting the environment, favoring groups with needs, betting on products and fabric local business, promote sustainable mobility, use biodegradable products, reduce the use of plastic and paper at the event, etc. On the galazzotrail.com website, you can find a summary with the main SDG development actions that we carried out in 2024. This race is organized by Fundacion Calvia 2004 and the Calvia Town Hall. It has the support of the Reserva Park, Tribe, and the arbitration of the Balearic Mountaineering and Climbing Federation. In addition to these entities, sports clubs, associations, companies, and above all, a great volunteer team make the event possible. We hope you enjoy Galazzo Trail 2024, and remember, smile when you cross the finish finish.